why I've been Mini 2 for quite a while at the moment. So I thought first thing I'll do was check out the DJI Fly app and there was an update on that. So I updated the Fly app and then I'm going to check. I haven't updated the DJI Mini 2 for quite a while now. So I'm going to check uh, that the Mini 2 is up to date. So what I've done, I'm just going into the drone itself. Now I've already turned on the Mini 2 drone itself. I'm going to go over to updates, check the updates, just checking the version, and it's saying I need to do an update on the Mini 2, so we just do that. So this is the update that we had for the Mini 3 Pro the other day, and if you look at it, it's something to do with the Japanese RID. So I'm going to let that uh, load up. But what I would do for you guys is I will speed up the process because um, sometimes it can take a while. It's only 49 OMB. Uh, and there's the new number for it. So I'm just going to make a note of that. So everything's okay. Right, so the drone's been turned off. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn on the drone again. So I've got it onto the DJI Mini 2. Saying, oh, it's on there as well still, it's been updated. So we're just gonna press the go fly. We're going to go and make sure that everything's up to date. So we just go into the about and we just check. Let's just check in. Right, so I'll make a note yet again of the RC firmware. So that's all ready now. So I can come out of that, go back into that. So the drone is already taken off. I will go out tomorrow and test fly the Mini 2 with the new firmware update. Guys, if you've got any questions, please add them below as always. And yeah, I'll catch you on another video.